Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's been a long time since I was filming or giving any updates. Uh, it's been uh, quite many things happening since I left Switzerland. As you can see, I'm in Mauritania. Oh, sorry, still in Morocco. Probably tomorrow I'm gonna be in Mauritania. Uh, spontaneously end up here uh, as I was com planning completely different plan after Europe but uh, as I mentioned many things happen in Switzerland which I gonna mention later but uh, yeah as you saw in the last video uh, I was doing a race in Morocco uh, also I don't know if I mentioned or even I was filming after Switzerland I'm not sure let's pass this car behind me But I will remind you what's happened after Switzerland if I didn't film it. Uh, so I, uh, yeah, I cycle across uh, Liechtenstein, was it uh, France, Belgium, Netherlands, Germany, something like that. It was very fast, like uh, five days, five countries or something like that. Uh, then from Germany I fly to Morocco where I was doing uh, this uh, Morocco bike adventure self-supporting bikepacking uh, let's say race against time because there was a 14 days limit but anyway uh, so for that I want to say big thanks for uh, sponsoring that event for Henny and Elena from Australia so guys you are the best as always thank you so much uh, but let's back here uh, after race I took uh, I think uh, three weeks off in Morocco was bike backpacking with my bicycle not alone uh, and then uh, yesterday I took a bus to Dakla, 1000 kilometers uh, where I arrived this morning after 18 hours in a bus I had only two hours of sleep and now I'm uh, cycling in Western Sahara uh, from Dakla is 380 kilometers to the border of Mauritania where I'm heading kilometers to Mauritania yesterday smashed it to 85 yeah, I was aiming for 300 but I got a puncture so had to pitch a tent on the side of the road having some snack There's nothing, but uh, yeah, more or less okay. From the outside, it was looking like uh, some kind of construction, just sand and uh, but everything destroyed. But...
wind is hot it's like you open the oven you get this smash from the, the heat <laughs> ah, nothing much just a few settlements along the way where I can take a break from the sun I think these days if uh, nothing much change uh, I was checking the weather cast it was uh, 35, 37 uh, so definitely not easy to cycle in the midday but Usually nothing much there, water, if you're lucky it's cold, and if you're lucky you can get cold soda too, some chips and some cookies. Let's see what they have it here. Bonjour. As you can see, I finally find some meat. <laughs> it's quite bigger uh, town than I was expecting. Scorpion crossing the road Very very small a coffee but uh, there is no coffee nobody understand me what I want 
What's up, snacks? I'm gonna use this uh, shack. It's still 100 kilometers to the capital. I think this is the some small village. See they sell here dry fish. We are very close to the Atlantic Ocean back again. A few small shops, a few cafes. And uh, yeah, nothing much. Si jambu ba? Eh. Jambo, jambo. Jambo. Mambo jambo. Eh, eh, eh. Eh, Eh, Ah, what a what amazing moment. <laughs> So I'm about to pitch a tent an hour or so and I have only one and a half liter water left to the border which is doable with the cooking and then uh, 50 kilometers cycling with uh, 0.7 I mean uh, more or less it's possible but I was like ah saving water and the guy stopped just give me one and a half liter water amazing what a moment Wow, just, it's incredible, incredible. Uh, so yeah, and you can see the landscape is uh, changing. Slowly, slowly, more bushes, more trees, even the grass. I'm not far away on that side. is a big river of Senegal, which is also a border of Mauritania and Senegal. So, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 it's amazing. Finally some changes. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
kind of first time in Africa since Europe I'm putting my tent still in the daylight. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Um, I'm in a kind of swampy area. Luckily it's more or less dry. And, uh, yeah, is this... Uh, I saw five maybe already uh, uh, warthogs, warthogs, or how do they call uh, the African, uh, like a wild pig, or you know, with the big uh, thing. <laughs> uh, ah, there is one. I'm not sure if you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. there is one more. So yeah. It's kind of still soft, but uh, oh, it's gonna be okay. So I'm pretty sure at night they're gonna come here for water because <laughs> a lot of activity here. So up also there is jackals and uh, some other animals. Some, uh, few kilometers uh, outside National Park. Uh, I still have those one past the door lifts. It's the last one from local Altea. Very delicious. So we're gonna have a dinner. This is for dinner and uh, yeah, tomorrow Senegal.